I would like to say that success for me is being happy and NJCU has really allowed me to find my happiness in helping others succeed. I've been able to serve in, in various leadership roles and various projects where I've been able to help others find their passion and that's literally the, the definition of success for me and I hope that after I graduate I can continue to do the same thing for others and that would for me be success. I remember being a 19-year-old freshman at NJCU, and I was in my first year experience course, and my first, my professor, Ms. Rosa Perez, she, uh, she was talking about being a successful college student, and I wasn't doing as best as I could in class. I was falling asleep, I was not doing homework, and she, instead of failing me, she brought me into her office and we had a conversation. She said, I'm gonna put you in a mentoring program so then you can feel more connected to the university um, and you can be more involved. And because of that, I was paired up with a student named Christian Diaz, and he ended up running and becoming student government president. And under his tutelage, I was able to meet so many different administrators, so many different opportunities I was able to take advantage of on campus, and eventually I became student government president. Um, and I want to thank Ms. Rosa Perez for putting me on the journey to be a successful NJCU student. So, in five years, I hope to see myself finishing my master's program and being a student affairs professional somewhere in the tri-state area uh, because my experiences in undergrad really uh, made me realize that this is what I want to do for as a career. And in 10 years, I see myself you know, being a vice president of student affairs or hopefully maybe a president of university um, and well done with my doctorate. So um, I, I really see myself living a life of service in student affairs and being working in a university environment because uh, I've seen what other student affairs professionals and administrators have done for me. And if it weren't for them at the college level, I probably would have never finished. So I would like to have that same experience and the same impact for others. I just want to be, I just want to be successful. I just want to be, I just want to be successful. I just wanna be, I just wanna be successful. To me, success is reaching the goals that I set for myself, regardless of the obstacles that I may face, and knowing that I tried my absolute best to reach them. My journey here at NJCU was amazing. From working in the Office of Admissions to working in the Office of Campus Life, being a peer mentor to student ambassador, and finally being the president of Psychology Society. I am so proud to say that it has opened so many doors for me for the future. I see myself at a university working in higher education and student affairs and impacting student lives just like my mentors have done for me. I have a few um, definitions of success and I've realized that throughout my life. One of them being going from failure to failure, through struggle, through challenge, and maintaining that enthusiasm. I feel like that's important. You're gonna be faced with a lot of things in life and a lot of things that are gonna make you wanna give up. And I think that learning to really, truly believe in yourself and keep moving forward and realizing what you wanna do it's gonna help you in the long run and with your enthusiasm, but also to waking up every day um, and realizing that you know you're loving what you do and you're waking up doing what you love, and you know that's 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 a success for me. Like I want to achieve that one day. Waking up, always helping people um, the best way I can. And that's why I chose health in the first place. It's because um, health is a weakness of mine and I want to make it a strength. And with that being said, I want to help everyone else make it a strength of their own. Also with NJCU has helped me in my journey with amazing faculty and advisors and colleagues. 
I don't think I would still be here if I didn't have my advisor and my colleagues believing in me um, because they've, they, they see so much in me that I don't even see in myself. They see the strength, they see the passion. And sometimes, yeah, I do wanna give up. I do wanna, cause I'm so overwhelmed and with life and struggles. And I feel like my advisor and you know, the colleagues and everyone in NJCU has really helped me guide me and believed in me, helped me keep going in my, in my journey here. So um, yeah, I love NJCU. I I just wanna be, I just wanna be successful. I just wanna be, I just wanna be successful.